Hello, welcome to another wiki procedure and today we are going to look on how we can import household goods and personal effects for foreign diplomats, governments or international organizations in Kenya. Uh, down here below we have given you a link which is going to direct you to your, our wiki procedure website page where we have given you detailed information on how you can go about the importation process. Additionally, on our right hand side of our screen, we have included a uh, select language uh, option where you can select the language which is easy for you to comprehend for example by choosing swahili all the information on, on our wiki, proce wiki procedure website page will be translated to swahili and i'll be able to read through the information with ease and to revert back to english i can I'll just simply click english and all the information is translated back to english additionally we have included external links to other websites where you, you can visit and get more information about how to import household goods and personal effects into Kenya. And we are going to visit uh, these websites and go through uh, this application process as we move on with the presentation today. But before we move on, I will urge you to click the subscribe button on our wiki procedure YouTube page and also click the like button on the, on this video right here so you, you can get notification whenever we upload new content on our wiki procedure YouTube page so let's get back to our presentation and the list of items which you're going to cover in this session include need for importation of household goods and personal effects the eligibility criteria required documents steps to follow in making the application the fees the validity period the processing time offices and contact information and any other information that we may find relevant on how to import household goods and personal effects of foreign diplomats government or international organizations so welcome to our presentation today which is brought to you by wikiprocedure.com need for importation of household goods and personal effects for foreign diplomat, government and international organization. This allows foreign diplomat governments or international organization to import their household goods and personal effects into Kenya duty free. And, and they can import uh, uh, their personal effects and uh, household goods duty free into Kenya during their stay here. The eligibility criteria is as follows. The following people are eligible to import uh, their personal effects and household goods into Kenya duty free, foreign government diplomats, international organizations and their entitled staff arriving from a place outside Kenya. You need to know that full diplomatic sh shipments are not subject to inspection however international members of organizations and government members are subject to inspection the required documents you need the passport original diplomatic passport uh, proib forms approved by the uh, uh, ministry of foreign affairs which exempts diplomats from inspection or uh, pro 1A form required for if importing alcohol approved by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, um, a comprehensive inventory of all high-tech equipment, computers, electronics, stereos, and uh, etc. All, all with a comprehensive uh, uh, inventory of all electronic equipment, a PIN certificate which is available at the Kenya Revenue Authority port release order and custom release original bills of landing uh, original export certificate and logbook in case they are importing a vehicle port release order and custom release a valid work permit uh, documents from the ministry of foreign affairs three letters endorsed by the government umbrella addressed to the custom director uh, shipping agency and bonded warehouse exempting um, uh, these goods from being taxed steps to follow in making the application you need to know that diplomatic goods are not subject to inspections with the approved uh, pro 1b form uh, from the ministry of foreign affairs 
and diplomats must be present in Kenya when ship shipment arrives. So this application can only be done in person and upon reaching the port of entry in Kenya, uh, the diplomat or his agents or staff supposed to fill in the declaration form which uh, you then must present, uh, you must be present during the custom clearance. This can be done by the diplomat international organization representative or their staff. However, you can nominate a representative such as a freight forwarder, customer broker, a friend or a relative to act on your behalf. So any one of those can fill the declaration form. And you are supposed to declare all goods, household goods, personal effects that you have imported at the customs point of entry and attach a list of all goods that are declared as free entry goods. Attach the required documents and this uh, may include, uh, we have already gone through this list, the passport, the Pro 1B form available at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Pro 1A form also available at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, comprehensive inventory, port release order, original bill of landing, export clearance certificate or logbook, and letters endorsed by the government umbrella, and submit the declaration form and the required documents to the custom office. After submission, the custom office will verify the documents and the de declaration form. Then the importer or his agents will then pay taxes and duty, if any, at the cashier division and then contact the customs to release the goods. Finally, the custom office uh, will send their customer, uh, their cus uh, custom officer, uh, to inspect the imported household e uh, effects against the declaration. If there is no discrepancy between the declaration made and the goods inspected, all the goods will be released. Fees: No fees is charged for the importation of household goods and personal effects for foreign diplomats or international organization. Household goods and personal effects are duty free. The validity period is 30 days from the time of entry into Kenya and goods which have been uh, shipped into Kenya are supposed to be cleared for, uh, within 30 days. And we also support, you also you need to note that uh, you are the foreign diplomat or international organi organization representative is supposed to be in Kenya uh, by the time the goods uh, reach uh, Kenya. The processing time takes a maximum of seven days. The contact location and information of uh, the of the of the customs department is that their head office is located at the Kenya Revenue Authority at Hele Selassie Avenue, and you can also visit them through their website of www.kra.go.ke. Other information is that the following category of people are privileged to import duty-free goods into Kenya. The president, uh, goods uh, for use, the president, now the goods used for, by the president, the Kenya Armed Forces, all goods including materials, supplies, equipment, machinery, and motor vehicle for the use uh, of the Kenya Armed Forces, the Commonwealth and other governments, diplomatic privileges, aid agencies, and the African Development Bank. So thank you for watching. And uh, once again, I urge you to go ahead and click the like button if you like the video and click the subscribe button on our YouTube page. So for a quick recap, um, Upon reaching the point of entry, fill in the declaration form. You can do this by yourself or using a customs agent, clearing and forwarding agent, a friend or a relative. Uh, declare all the household goods and personal effects and attach the list. Uh, uh, attach the list to the uh, application form, uh, to the declaration form. Uh, attach the required documents and we have the list of the required documents. Submit the dec declaration form required documents and required documents to the custom office. After submission, the custom office will verify uh, the documents and the declaration form and you'll be required to pay taxes if any at the cashier division and finally the custom office is going to inspect the imported household, effect, household goods and personal effects against the declaration form of, and if there is no discrepancies, the goods will be released immediately. So that's it uh, 
uh, with importation of household and household goods and personal effects for foreign for foreign diplomats or governments and international organizations uh, hit the like button hit the subscribe button and i add you uh, you can also browse through other uh, procedures to see which one can also help you in your importation process so i wish you all the best in your importation and uh, have a good day